Originally, producer Don Murphy had intended to produce a movie based on another Hasbro property, G.I. Joe. However, following the U.S. invasion of Iraq in March 2003, a movie entitled G.I. Joe was no longer considered viable, so Carol Monroe, who was in charge of Hasbro's movie department at that time, suggested doing a Transformers movie instead. Tom DeSanto joined the project as a second producer and wrote a treatment that he and Murphy tried to shop around for a while. The treatment would eventually remain entirely unused, but DeSanto would try to get a writing credit regardless, even though none of the screenwriters had ever actually seen his treatment. The movie was officially announced for the first time in June 2003. Steven Spielberg signed up as executive producer in 2004, while John Rogers was confirmed as screenwriter in November of the same year. Less than, no wiki greater than in February 2005, Rogers was replaced by Alex Kurtzman and Roberto Orci, who drastically reworked Rogers' original script. Spielberg tried to convince Michael Bay to direct the movie in late July 2005, but Bay initially declined, having no interest in a toy movie. He later changed his mind after attending Transformer School at Hasbro, but decided to make the movie realistic and accessible for adult viewers. A few days after a list of names of the human cast had been leaked on the internet, Shia LaBeouf was confirmed as the first cast member. Producer Don Murphy, Hasbro and the screenwriters all favored Peter Cullen and Frank Welker as voice actors for Optimus Prime in Megatron. Bay had both auditioned, but only hired Cullen, while preferring Hugo Weaving as Megatron. However, Welker still gets to voice Megatron, alongside Cullen as Prime, in the video game adaption of the movie, Transformers The Game, as well as in Transformers, Beginnings, an animated, sort of, version of IDW's prequel comic miniseries that was available on a Wall Asterisk Mart exclusive bonus disc included with the movie DVD.